Chelsea asked questions about the signing of Willian with a free status of transfer this summer. Willian spent seven seasons at Chelsea and helped the club win two Premier League titles, the FA Cup, Carabao Cup, and the Europa League for his time at Stamford Bridge. Chelsea held an initial talks about contracting him ahead of the new season because they considered Willian as a backup target in their summer transfer plan. However, even though the conversation report is at an advanced stage, the Brazilian star chose to sign a new contract with Fulham, he said, I'm really happy. Happy to sign another year with Fulham. It's nice to continue my work last season with all my teammates and all clubs. I think this is a club that can do better this season, so I like to continue this extraordinary adventure. The move back to Stamford Bridge will be a big surprise for fans to see it, however, Willian made the right decision by signing a new contract with Fulham because he would get the playing time he wanted. In Chelsea he will only sit on the bench every week waiting for the season to end and at this career stage it doesn't need to happen. Caicedo has set his heart to move to Chelsea this summer. Chelsea are in negotiations with Brighton about the agreement to sign Caicedo because Mauricio Pochettino wants to rebuild his midfield. The discussion is ongoing between the club and understood moving in a positive direction, with Caicedo has explained his desire to move to Stamford Bridge, according to Daily Express. Caicedo has a heart to move to Chelsea and its establishment will not change regardless of the offer from the Premier League rival club. Manchester United has been credited with an interest in Ecuador, while Arsenal and Liverpool have previously been linked. Chelsea hopes to complete the agreement in the coming days so that Caicedo can join the club pre-season tour. But, the Seagull believes that the 21-year-old player must be valued the same as Declan Rice, who joined Arsenal from West Ham by paid £105 million. Caicedo has become the main target of Pochettino's main transfer with Chelsea requires an additional midfield. Chelsea suffered a new injury to Wesley Fofana. Chelsea got a blow ahead of their preseason tour in the United States with Wesley Fofana absent on the way due to knee problems. Chelsea defender Wesley Fofana is doubtful to start a new season due to a knee injury. Chelsea flew to the United States this week for a preseason tour that featured five matches. New head coach Mauricio Pochettino has chosen a squad containing 29 players, which features a number of prospects and young players too. Strengthen the number, however, there are a number of important absences, including Rhys James who may still join the group in the future after recently fell ill and undergo a knee examination. Armando Brojev will not take risks when he tried to increase his rehabilitation from a serious knee injury he suffered in December, while Marcus Bettinelli and Benoit Badiashile were also absent. You could say the most worrying about Pochettino and clubs in general is Fofana, who is again said to have a knee injury. Since the £70 million transfer from Leicester City last summer, Fofana only made 12 appearances as a starter and 3 appearances as a substitute in all competitions, 5. Others became a starter in the Champions League, according to Evening Standard, the 22-year-old injury is currently being valued and his plan will remain in Cobham. The French international player has been disturbed by injury problems during his time at Stamford Bridge, with two knee problems making him absent from October to February. Chelsea are ready to sell Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang with only £5 million this summer. Chelsea has set a payment of only £5 million for the head of striker Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang because the striker is likely to move to Marseille. The Gabon striker arrived at Stamford Bridge with a price of £12 million from Barcelona last summer to join his former boss, Thomas Tuchel, at the club. However, after Tuchel's dismissal in September, Aubameyang struggled to make an impression under Graham Potter and was eliminated from the Champions League squad. Both players and clubs are now willing to separate. The Blues really want to release it with a free transfer status. However, they are happy to sell the striker for £5 million with Marseille will offer Aubameyang a way out of West London. According to Fabrizio Romano, the 34-year-old player has agreed to an agreement with the French club and but Goal.com in France reported that he was looking for payment for Gabon's top scorer. Chelsea are willing to sell Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang with only £5 million with Marseille ready to swoop. Chelsea are interested in removing the striker after the owner of Todd Bowley made a royal transfer in January. Aubameyang played 21 times for Chelsea last season, only scored three goals when he struggled to enter the team under the care of Potter and then Frank Lampard. Chelsea has offered the striker to Saudi Arabia, 
But it seems that Aubameyang will revive his career in France where he previously enjoyed the previous times in his career. The target West Brom Omari Hutchinson is available this summer, as reported by The Athletic, Omari Hutchinson has been expelled from the club pre-season tour to focus on securing loan moves from Stamford Bridge. West Brom had previously shown interest in the player and would be happy to see that he was available. The baggies must act quickly, because Hutchinson will definitely attract a lot of interest from other places. Hutchinson began his career at the Chelsea Academy before switching to the Arsenal young team at a young age and then chose to return to Stamford Bridge when there was an opportunity in 2022. The Jamaican international, who appeared twice now requires regular playing time to help him achieve his potential. He will get it at Hawthorne's. Adding Hutchinson to the Carlos Corberan squad will be a big boost and welcome to West Brom this summer. Inter Milan hurt when the Chelsea star opened the door to Juventus, the big update in the sustainable pursuit of the Serie A Inter Milan giant on Chelsea star Romelu Lukaku was revealed on Friday night, in the explosive report revealed by the transfer expert Gianluca in Marzio some time ago, it was revealed that Inter officials had been very disappointed, hurt and angry to Lukaku. This emerged in the middle of the claim that the Belgian player, for the past few days, has failed to respond to outreach efforts from staff and players in the blue half of the Milan division. Not only that, Inter had studied opening from Lukaku to move to his heavy rivals, Juventus, Juve is understood to have identified the 30-year-old player as a potential substitute for Dusan Blahovic. In the midst of the ongoing speculation around the future of the Serbian player in Turin, with the now open communication channel between Juve and the Chelsea player, Di Marzio concluded that it cannot be ruled out that Inter will decide to release if Lukaku does not show a different attitude in the next few weeks. Chelsea are now moving for gems very talented, Chelsea has now submitted an opening offer for Mateus Franca from Flamengo, with Todd Boley willing to pay £21 million needed to secure the attacker's signature, according to the latest report from Globo Esport, Fabrizio Romano recently reported that Franca had been followed by the Blues for some time, while also saying that the player himself would be very open to move, Romano said. Mateus Franca was highly appreciated. He was the player they had followed for a long time. I can mention that the player will be very excited about the possibility of joining Chelsea. Now, it seems that the Brazilian player will be given the opportunity to move to Stamford Bridge. According to Globusport, Chelsea has now submitted an opening offer. The Blues are not the only Premier League club that submitted an offer for the 19-year-old player. Flamengo club Bruno Spindle club director has confirmed that Crystal Palace has also submitted a proposal. Chelsea are ready to explore the potential transfer market to replace injured stars, Chelsea will reportedly be prepared to explore the market for the signing of the potential in the middle defense this summer if injured at Wesley Fofana proven serious and makes it absent for a long time, this, according to Fabrizio Romano, spoke on his YouTube channel, reporter explained that even though there was nothing more advanced in the department at this time, it could be an option for the Blues if they were worried that Fofana would be absent for a long time. Chelsea already have Thiago Silva, Inwa Badiashile and Levi Colwell as options at the central defender, but they might be able to do it by making sure they have protection for Fofana if he misses a few weeks or months this season. Colwell is another player whose future is doubtful, but Romano insisted that he was still not sold. Leeds is now preparing to beat Fulham. The latest report claims that Leeds United have defeated clubs like West Bromwich Albion, Fulham and Sheffield United for the signing of the Chelsea Ethan Ampadu exile player with an agreement of £7 million. It is expected to be announced this week, Ampadu, has returned to Chelsea after four consecutive times lent for one season in Leipzig, Sheffield United, Venezia and Spezia. He returned to Stamford Bridge, but his contract at Chelsea worth £37,000 per week will end in 2024. Fabrizio Romano has reported this morning that Ampadu almost joined Leeds in a £7 million transfer, with a medical examination for the 43-time Wales star. Personal agreements between Ampadu and Leeds have also been carried out. Although it seems that Leeds has been swooping and everything is smooth, it seems that actually Leeds has defeated many clubs for its signing. 
including the Fulham, Burnley, and Sheffield United Premier League teams, 